In heaven, they go to the portal, and this is what they declare over all their unsafe enemy members. And we actually have these little cards out there. I think they're like a dollar. All we do is it pays for the printing right now. How to declare over your family like they do in heaven. If you release your faith for that, then your family members will make it to heaven. It is a promise. You and your household shall be saved. It's in the word. If you abide in him and his word abides in you, you can ask what you will. We're going to ask and it shall be done unto you. If your family members are out there sinning as much as they can, you know, doing all kinds of stupid things for the devil, you are not supposed to live in turmoil. You are not supposed to live in turmoil and fear and anxiety. You're not supposed to live in any of those things. You're living your life for him in the face of what they're doing. You let them see the love and the joy and the life of God in you. That'll shock them. Amen. It's not like you're ignoring what they're doing. You're just not going to let it ruin your life. Amen? Amen. And the other thing you're going to learn is how to declare over your family members. Amen. It's so important to do. This is what they say in heaven. They go to that portal. They look down at their unsafe family members. They're not crying and falling on the ground. Okay. There's no grief or uh, ang anxiety in heaven. They already know the power of God. Besides, when they look down here, they see the spirit realm too. They see that your angels who are with you. They know the operations of the Holy Spirit that they declared over you before they left. Those words will remain until they come to fullness. Amen? Amen. Your words will remain, so make sure you're speaking life. You hear more of that tonight. Say, Father, Father I declare... That my, family that my family will become mighty children of God. Will become mighty children of God. They, will be free in Jesus name. they will be free in Jesus' name. They will not miss their destiny. They will not miss their destiny. They'll become the living testimony of the saving power of, power of Jesus, Christ. Jesus Christ. And I stand in faith. I stand in faith. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Father, I just, I speak a blessing over your children right now, God, that they don't lose this revelation, that it remains with them forever. I ask that you give them revelation of yourself, Father. Give them encounters in heaven, Father. I know that's your desire for them to know you in fullness, for them to be free, stay free, and become dangerous against the enemy. And everyone said, Amen. Thank you for allowing me to share.